Community care will end drive-up testing at two of its sites due to a surge in people trying to get tested. They say because of limited staff and resources, it was compromising safety. It's yet another trickle-down effect of the statewide spike in COVID-19 cases. As KXAN investigator Kevin Clark also learned, more than two dozen community care employees have tested positive. Community care is a COVID-19 testing staple in Travis County, especially for those without insurance, but the need has become greater than a couple of its drive-up locations could allow. We could have well over 100 uh, that would show up, and you know, you, you can tell that's more than, than double of what we were, we were uh, available for, so we knew right away when, when that transition started to happen that, that we need to, to try to figure some things out. As a result, community care will relocate drive-up testing at its Pflugerville and Dove Springs locations. No one is going to come to a testing center uh, unless they have a worry. Um, so, so we know that we need to have a good efficient process so that we can move folks through as quickly as we can. But overwhelmed sites aren't the only result of a testing boom. I listened in on Community Care's meeting Thursday where officials say lab processing of test kits is backed up. With turnaround times up to 10 days on the extreme end, they said it brings down the value of testing altogether. By the time someone gets their test result, they're already well into and maybe even beyond their most infectious period. As a result, community care stopped asymptomatic testing and says those with the highest risk get preferential testing. Lab partner Quest Diagnostics tells us it's trying to process a workload of 115,000 tests per day and its average turnaround time is three to five days. Kevin Clark, KXAN Investigates. Community Care says 28 of its employees have tested positive for COVID-19. They say none of those were patient to employee transmission, with five cases coming at one site. The Central Health Affiliate says it's still trying to find new locations for drive-up testing in Pflugerville and Dove Springs. Williamson County is working to improve its COVID-19 testing in partnership with Family Emergency Room. Currently, Family Emergency Room operates two test sites. A new contract with the county means that people won't have to wait for a call back to schedule an appointment. Family Emergency Room will handle all of that. The system started testing people without symptoms in May. For now, they'll only schedule testing for people experiencing symptoms. But the county says they'll be able to use more of their clinics. We expect more details on the partnership Monday.